Hello everybody, this is Emma, and welcome back to Let's Play Back to the Future of the Game, and this is episode 4, ladies and gentlemen. Double Visions. Yes, we are off. Citizen Plus? Citizen Plus? <laughs> huh. Okay, so we are in this box here, looks like. Doesn't look like it's on. That's not very relaxing. Okay. So we'll just have to go around, look around. Make sure the McFly boy is prepped for his Citizen Plus treatment by the time I finish with my husband. How is Citizen Brown? I'm afraid it's worse than we imagined. He's gone completely antisocial. Darn. We're using every tool at our disposal to snap him out of it. But I fear that nothing short of a complete personality rebuild will bring our leader back to us. And it's all McFly's fault? Unbelievable, isn't it? One teenage hooligan has brought Hill Valley to the brink of ruin. Ah, well. Let me know when he's ready. I'll be tending to Citizen Brown. Hmm. I gotta get out of here and rescue Doc. Yeah. Um... Hey, let me out! Okay. Someone's locked up all my stuff. I'll never get that combination on my own. Okay. What can we do? Let's see, is the intercom again maybe? Hello? What? Hey, could you get me a burger or something? The only food I've had today is a tofu dog. Regrettably, sir, the rigors of the Citizen Plus treatment require you to begin the process with an empty stomach. Why is all my stuff locked in a cage? In order to ensure that Citizen Plus patients don't injure themselves, their belongings are placed in a locked box until the completion of their Citizen Plus treatment. Injure themselves? It's a very intensive process. Some people can't handle it. Um... Okay. Can I take a look at my stuff for a second? Why? I, uh, want to make sure my guitar neck isn't getting bent. What? Come on, man. My parents spent a fortune on that thing. Fine. Back away from the door, sir. Okay. Hmm. There. How's the guitar? Looks fine. I guess it's okay. Good. This voice sounds familiar, though. I'll never get that combination on my own. I know. Yeah, there must be someone. Um. Hello? What now? Let me out of here. Sorry, sir, but Citizen Plus patients aren't allowed to exit their waiting rooms until the Citizen Plus treatment chamber has been suitably prepped for their procedure. You can't keep me in here. It's against the law. When you signed your Citizen Plus treatment agreement, you gave the Citizen Plus ward legal approval to incarcerate you until the completion of your Citizen Plus treatment. He didn't sign anything. I didn't sign anything. Of course you did, sir. Citizen Edna handed me the paperwork herself. Of course she did. Yeah. I don't suppose you believe me if I told you that Edna forged my signature? That's a good one, sir. <laughs> Take another look at my stuff. No. 
I don't suppose you believe me if I told you that Edna forged my signature? That's a good one, sir. Okay, so we can't do anything else here. <sighs> Is that you? Who else would it be? Where are you? Back in the garage. What are you doing in the Citizen Plus ward? Edna threw me in here. She can't do that to my son. How can I help? Not that I'm not happy that you're here, but why are you here? I'm looking for your mother. Mom? After you left, she and I had a big old fight, and, well, she went and signed herself up for a full battery of Citizen Plus treatments. Can you tell her about Biff? I tried. You know your mother. Once she puts her mind to something, she's a regular force of nature. I huh. figure that if I can just find her, maybe I can talk her out of this foolishness. Is there any way you can help me escape this loony bin? What did you have in mind? I don't know. Maybe override the security systems or something. Override the what? Son, this isn't a science fiction movie. I tried to peek over the guard's shoulder to get the combination, but he's too tall. Over his shoulder? Hold on. What? I may have it on tape. Zoom, oh. enhance. Zoom, enhance. Ha! What? The camera was high enough to see over his shoulder. Nice work, Dad. Yeah. The combination is 2 left, 8 right, 18 left, 32 right. All right. Hey, okay. your guitar! I'm sorry, I tried to throw it out. Yeah, the guitar is pretty cool, but this is what I care about. No fair making your dad all misty, son. Okay. So what do we do now? We have a newspaper, we have a photograph of McFly, and... Alright, um... Just come again. Hello? What now? Can I take another look at my stuff? No. Mm -hmm. Well, I have my stuff, so it doesn't matter. <sighs> it's empty. Ah, of course it is. Um. Dad! How can I help, son? Is there any way you can help me escape this loony bin? What did you have in mind? I don't know. Maybe... Override the security systems or something. Override the what? Son, this isn't a science fiction movie. Dad, those Citizen Plus watches are gonna turn everyone in Hill Valley into robots, starting with Citizen Brown. I always suspected digital watches were evil. <laughs> Not the watches, Dad, it's Edna. <laughs> He's completely lost it. Citizen Edna's crazy? Oh, that's not good. Although it would explain a lot. I know this is a lot to accept, but I've got to rescue Citizen Brown so that we can go back in time and stop him from ever marrying Edna in the first place. You're right, son. That is a lot to accept. So let's forget you ever said it. Just concentrate on getting you out of there. Yeah, maybe that's for the best. Yeah. So, have you found Mom yet? Not yet. You wouldn't believe how many cameras they've got around here. It's nice that you're concerned about Mom, but couldn't you come down here yourself? Oh, I couldn't do that. I'm probably in enough trouble with the authorities already. No, I think it's better for everyone if I stay here in my garage with my televisions and cameras. Stay close, Dad. I'm as close as I can get, Martin. Maybe we can, uh... I can't plug my guitar into that. No. Um. How about the squawk box? Playing my guitar over the speaker is going to attract a lot of attention. I should wait until I've got the right audience. Really? And when is that?
don't think a picture of my dad would be useful here. Okay, you got me beat, game. You got me beat. beat. Is there? Jennifer. Jen? Hey, Jennifer! I gotta get her attention. Dad. How can I help, son? Could you let me talk to Jennifer? Jennifer Parker? Yeah, she's in the room next door. Let's see, that'd be waiting room beta. Got it. You're all patched in, son. Jennifer. Martin, is that you? Where are you? I'm over here, in the camera. Oh, Martin, aren't you in enough trouble already? Trouble? Jen, what are you talking about? You know, with all the drinking and the PDAs. Jennifer, oh, what's wrong with you? You sound strange. I used to be strange, Martin. But thanks to my First Citizen Plus treatment, I'm well on my way to becoming an average, well-adjusted teenager. Oh, no. Citizen Plus. Oh, no. Jen, not you, too. Why is your door open? Now that I'm finished with my Citizen Plus treatment, I'm free to go whenever I want. I'm just waiting for the nice guard to escort me out. Jen, snap out of it. This isn't the real you. I mean, it's kind of like the real, real you, but not like the real you in this timeline. Wow, that's... I know, it sounds crazy. I'd never call you crazy, Martin. You're just sick. I should know I used to be sick, too. But <laughs> now, I never want to spray paint a Buick or listen to rock music ever again. Oh, come on, dude. That's fun, isn't it? Hey, do you know what time it is? No. Didn't they give you some kind of digital watch when you were done with all that brainwashing? The Citizen Plus watch? I won't get one of those for another five or six treatments. Rats. How'd you wind up in the Citizen Plus program anyway? My dad signed me up, and it's a good thing too. I was completely out of control. I kinda liked it. Hey, on your way out, do you think you could help me break out of here? Oh, I couldn't do that, Martin. It's against the rules. Hmm. Jen, this whole Citizen Plus thing is a scam. Edna's using it to take control of everyone in Hill Valley, including her husband. You know, Citizen Edna told me you were having paranoid delusions, but I had no idea. Hmm. So, what was your Citizen Plus treatment like anyway? It's... it's... well, that's weird. I don't really remember. Must be a side effect of the treatments. Okay. Okay, forget breaking out. Could you at least come visit me? It's it's kind of lonely in here. I don't think it's a good idea for us to see each other until you've undergone your first Citizen Plus treatment. Why not? Because your gosh danged hormones are out of control, Martin. <laughs> okay. Come on, Jen. You don't really want a life without rock and roll, do you? Rock and roll? Ooh. Just the thought of the pelvis pulsing three chord power ballads you used to play makes me all queasy inside. Blech. Blech. Okay. Could you hang around for a few minutes? It's nice to have someone to talk to. I'll be here until the guard comes for me. Then I'll really have to tell him about how you're hijacking the cameras. Oh, come on. Don't be a narc. I'm not a narc. I'm a good citizen. Well. Um, okay. Okay, I see. Now it is time for us to do the squawk box thing. Okay, Jane, here's a little something I think you're gonna like. At least, I hope you still do. Martin? Jennifer? Oh. Oh, Martin. Martin? What are you? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. What's going on here? 
I have no idea, sir. I was minding my own business, when all of a sudden the horrible noise started coming out of that camera. Well, that's not right. Yeah, well, neither is this. Oh, yeah! No one scrambles my brain, you hear me? No one. I'm Jennifer Parker, rock and roller. Yeah. Oh, yeah, right. All right. Yeah. Jen, no time for small talk, McFly. We need to get you disguised so we can walk out of here. Yeah. There's a cutscene. Calvin Klein underwear? Really? There. How do I look? A little short for a stormtrooper, but it'll have to do. Come on! Short. Okay, so in the next episode, we are going to go after Jen. So, thank you for watching, and uh, goodbye. I'm glad this project is back for another six, seven episodes. So, thank you for watching. Goodbye.